Here's three survival tips that could one day save your life. Starting a fire with almost no resources. All you need is batteries and foil, like a bubblegum wrapper. Just put the foil at the end of the batteries and it will start to heat up and burn. And once you get a flame, you could use things like Doritos to have a mini fire. Sending an emergency signal. Now that you know how to make a fire, you need a lot of smoke. To produce that, you could use fresh pine and spruce leaves, wet leaves from any other trees, or rubber materials. Another way to send a signal is by using something reflective, like a mirror, CD, metal, and even jewelry. Emergency number. A really handy thing to know is that most cell phones will dial your local emergency number even if you have no SIM card and no service. Places on Earth that no human has set foot on. This place is the Island of Snakes. It's in Brazil and is only visited by Brazilian military and some scientific researchers. You're not allowed to go there because there's one to five snakes everywhere you step. And the golden snake, which is one of the most dangerous snakes in the world, lives there. Grand Carpunsum is a mountain located in the kingdom of Bhutan. It's over 7,000 meters in the air and has never been touched by a human and never will. Because in 1994, climbing over 6,000 meters in the air was prohibited for religious reasons. And lastly, North Sentinel Island. The Indian government banned any contact with the island because of the aggressiveness from the people that live there. Recently, two fishermen decided to explore the island and they were killed by the people that live there. The worst school punishments. In 2011, a teacher from Albuquerque called the police because a student burped in class. The boy was then taken to juvenile prison for testing. Christopher Baker, who was a nine-year-old student from Kentucky, was put in a duffel bag for misbehaving in class. The school claimed that he was in the therapy bag for almost 20 minutes. Due to the mother's claims, the teachers involved were fired. At a school in New Jersey, a student accidentally spilled water on the lunchroom floor. When the assistant principal saw the incident, she forced 16 students to eat their lunch on the floor for 10 days. When the parents found out, they sued the school, winning $500,000. Finally, a five-year-old from Pennsylvania received a 10-day suspension for wanting to shoot her Hello Kitty bubble gun at another student. She said, I'll shoot you, you shoot me, and we'll play together. After the teacher heard the conversation, she sent her to the principal's office. And even though she just had a bubble gun, she was suspended for a terroristic threat. Four ways you've been secretly tricked by companies. In the list of ingredients on a product, manufacturers often use the scientific name of certain ingredients to confuse the customer. This way you don't quite understand if the ingredient is healthy or not. Limited time offers are a trick to create a sense of urgency so that you buy the product before the sale ends. But in reality, it's probably not a real offer or it may never end. Advertising agencies alter the photos of the products they're promoting in order to make them look more eye-catching. In most photos and commercials, they don't even use real food. They use glue for milk, car oil for syrup, and coffee bubbles are actually soap. Companies give a huge human character to an animal or object to get you to buy their product. It makes them look more adorable and it'll give you the confidence to buy it. Some examples are the Duracell Bunny and the Fruit Loops Toucan. 10 facts you didn't know that could save your life. If your house ever smells like fish for no reason, nine times out of 10, it's because there's an electrical fire. If you're in a foreign country and you need to call for help, but you don't know the emergency number, call 112 and it'll automatically connect you to the nearest helpline. If a tornado looks like it's not moving, it's actually moving towards you. If you ever wake up to the smell of gas, don't turn on a light. A spark from the light switch could blow up your entire house. Lying flat on your back is the best way to survive a falling elevator. If your hair suddenly stands up, duck and cover because you're about to be struck by lightning. If you ever fall off the edge onto the tracks, don't try and crawl back up. There's a crawl space built to go underneath in case this happens. If a deer runs across the road, it's better to hit it than swerve into the ditch. But if it's a moose, then it's better to swerve into the ditch. Because hitting a moose is like hitting a brick wall. Even if you have no service, you can still dial 911. In an emergency, your phone will connect to the nearest tower. If you ever get kidnapped into the back of a vehicle, disconnect the brake light wire so the cops will pull them over, then kick on the door to let them know that you're there. Here's what movies look like without special effects. The Mandalorian was filmed in a studio with one big screen. Here's how Spider-Man flies in the sky. Here's what Thanos actually looked like before special effects. Most racing scenes aren't actually filmed in the streets, but in a studio. Although Jumanji was filmed in a desert, some scenes had to be filmed in a studio. The actors who play the monkeys in Planet of the Apes actually look pretty funny. And here's what I look like without special effects. Here's what actually happens during sleep paralysis. Sleep paralysis is when you feel like you're awake, meaning you could see and hear, but your body's still asleep and unable to move. During this, you may be unable to move or speak for a couple seconds or even a few minutes. Some people also feel pressure on their chest, as if someone was sitting or standing on it. You might even be afraid because of a nightmare that you were having. This usually happens when you're first falling asleep or your body's getting ready to wake up. 
5 Places You Should Never Swim The boiling lake in Dominica is so dangerous that the magma underneath the surface makes the water so hot that you would be swimming in boiling water. Lake Kerche is one of the most toxic lakes on earth. Due to all the toxic waste that the Russian government introduced when toxic materials weren't as big of a problem. The Nile River is filled with crocodiles everywhere that could kill you. And if you manage to escape the crocodiles, you'll have snakes as a second problem. In the river and outside of it, you could probably find at least 15 venomous species. Jacob's Well is a lake located in Texas where you could dive really deep. But you have to be careful because there's caves below where people can get trapped. And lastly, Hanakape Beach has currents so strong that they even keep count of how many deaths there's been to scare people. And the number of people killed is 80. Here's the three most dangerous kid toys. In the 1990s, Rollerblade Barbie was released. Each Rollerblade used the same wheel mechanism they use in cigarette lighters. So when the Barbie was rolled, they would shoot out sparks. In 1996, the Cabbage Patch Snack Time Kid was released. It ate plastic foods that came with it and exited through a hole in the backpack. But the toy couldn't tell whether it was plastic, your finger, or your hair. And one girl's hair was ripped down to her scalp. Finally, in the 1990s, Nickelodeon released Moon Shoes, which you would strap onto your feet and the springs would help you jump higher. However, they weren't very safe and lots of people sprained and broke their ankles. Here's 5 things you didn't know about Spongebob. There was a replica of the Krusty Krab built in Palestine. The original name for Spongebob was Spongeboy Ahoy, but Spongeboy was copyrighted by a mob company. Tom Kenny, the voice actor for the anchovies, actually inhaled helium from a tank to do the voice. Carolyn Lawrence, the voice actor for Sandy, said she got lots of letters from prison and that was her biggest fan base. Barack Obama said his all-time favorite character is Spongebob Squarepants because he watched the show with his daughters. Now if you're from America or another country that doesn't have Spongebob on Netflix, you could click the link in my profile and download the app, then open it and change your location to Canada, and now when you search it up, you could watch it. This boy passed away in a car crash, then he was brought back to life, and what he said will shock you. Landon and his parents were in the car, then all of a sudden they felt a strong force hit them. It was an ambulance going to the hospital that crashed into them. Unfortunately, his dad passed away on impact, but his mom was able to be stabilized just in time. The paramedics didn't know that Landon was still in the car until they saw a shoe sticking out. He was rushed to the hospital where his heart stopped twice. The doctors then told his mom that he would survive. When he woke up, he said that he saw his dad in heaven. He also said that he saw two of his relatives, and lastly, he said that he saw two of his mom's other children. His mom was confused at first, but then remembered that she had two miscarriages before he was even born. But the part that shocked her the most is that she never told that to Landon because he was too young to understand. Three times animals took revenge on humans. A Russian hunter shot and wounded a Siberian tiger during his hunt. But the tiger didn't forget what had happened. And after a few hours found the place that he lived and waited for him. When he arrived, the tiger killed and ate him. A hunter shot a deer and thought it was dead. But the deer got up and attacked him with his antlers, resulting in six stitches to the head. In 2011, a group of hunters killed an elephant in India. But what they didn't expect is that the rest of the herd would take revenge. They destroyed 54 houses in the area. They hid during the day and destroyed everything around them at night. One in a million coincidences. These two trucks lined up and said Taylor Swift. This guy took off the mask and looks more like Mario than Mario does himself. The mountains on the truck lined up perfectly with the mountains in real life. These two ladies were dressed up almost the exact same and they're doing the same thing. This news reporter looks the exact same as the robber that's on the loose. The dumbest lottery winners. After winning $1.3 million in the California lottery, Dennis Rossi filed for divorce from Thomas Rossi so she wouldn't have to share the money with him. Thomas decided to sue her for violating state law and he kept all the money. Michael Carroll won $14 million when he was just 19. After claiming he wouldn't spend the money on dumb things, he bought multiple luxury cars, mansions, and other expensive things. To this day, he lost all his money and works at a cookie factory. Jack Whitaker won $315 million in the US lottery. When he claimed it, he took it all in cash. However, thieves broke into his house and took millions of dollars. Here's things that are bigger than you thought. Here's how big a traffic light is compared to a human. Here's a polar bear's paw compared to a human hand. Traffic signs are actually really big. Here's a regular sized moose compared to vehicles. Here's how big the Titanic is compared to a modern cruise ship. Here's how big a tornado is compared to a wind turbine. And here's how big the blade of a wind turbine is compared to a human. The most expensive things thrown away. JK Rowling who wrote Harry Potter gave an interviewer one of her books. He thought it would be a flop so he threw it in the trash. Today the first edition of the copy sells for over $80,000. In England one of the machines used by the British government to decipher secret messages during World War II was thrown into a recycling plant. The machine is valued at $10,000 and is considered one of the most important pieces of history in the world. A woman in the US took her 1976 Apple One computer to a recycling center. Not too long later the owners of the center auctioned the computer for $200,000. 
dollars. But they're now trying to find the former owner to share the money with. James Howell lost 7,500 bitcoins in 2013 after losing the hard drive that he stored them on. At the time, one coin was $130, but today each coin is $40,000, meaning he lost over $300 million. Five people who won the food lottery part 11. This person found two fruit by the foots in one package. This person got a bun from McDonald's covered in seeds. This person got nine pieces of cereal stuck together to make one big square. This person got an extra hot dog. And before I tell you the craziest one about this goldfish, I found this app that reads the lines on your palm and tells you what it means. Just press the button on my profile to get it. Finally, this person got a goldfish three times the size. Animals that are bigger than you thought. This is how big horses lungs are. This is how big a giant leatherback sea turtle is compared to a human. Here's how big a giant African land snail is compared to a hand. Here's how big a blue whale's heart is compared to a human. Here's how big eagle's claws are compared to a hand. And here's how big a saltwater crocodile is. Five photos you'll have to look at twice. At first it looks like there's a giant pigeon, but it's actually just sitting on a ledge and the person's walking in the distance. At first it looks like there's a human dog, but the dog's actually sitting beside its owner. At first this looks like some weird looking cat, but it's actually just two cats laying in the exact same position on each side. At first it looks like this fish has an arm, but the fish just got too close to the camera. And finally, it looks like this person has a small head, but it's just the head from the person in front of them. 2021 just got even crazier. A man in Brazil was exploring a forest when he came across this singing tree who said his name was Groot. On January 21st, a meteor hit the middle of the USA which left this big hole. The president has no clue what they're gonna do, but I'll keep you guys updated. And finally, in California, you can now have pet bears. This is Brutus. He was the first one adopted. 